MPM Fishing coming at you with a brand new video today. Today I'm out here with Ellis Fishing. Today we're going to be doing a little bit of jug fishing for some catfish. We're going to do a catch and cook video. So let's get started. Jug all rigged up um, using some bluegill. So let's go throw the jug out and if we get a bite, we'll chase it down the kayak. We got a bite on one of our jugs. Yeah, we're going jug fishing still. Like Let's see. Bite. Hopefully it's a huge catch on the jug. Still pulling a little bit. Yep, yeah, there's one. Definitely fish on this. Here, gotta get that shot. Wait, hang on, hang on. Wait, underwater. Pull. Oh. Is there one? Yeah, there's one on there, there's one on there. Look, look, look at him. Whoa. Look at him. One jug. Go forward, go forward. Hey, there's definitely one on there. Gotta get that underwater shot. Hey! Bro, you just splashed so much water in here. Alright, I'm excited. Go ahead, grab the handle. You feel him? Is he off? Oh no, he's on. Oh, yep. There we go, first catfish. First jug cat. It's your very first jug cat. Alright. We decided not to show the footage of us flaying the fish because it was pretty nasty and a lot of people don't like to see that so enjoy the video of us cooking it. Alright guys we put the two catfish fillets in a little bag of salt water. I'm gonna let it sit in the fridge for about 30 minutes so the salt will soak up into the meat and it'll hopefully make it better. So we're gonna wait about 30 minutes and then we're gonna start cooking. All right, guys, everything you need is salt, paprika, lemon, flour, oil, cornmeal, and butter. That's all you need to make a catfish. So let's get cooking. All right, in the bowl, you want to mix the cornmeal, the flour. You want about half cornmeal, half flour, uh, the paprika, and the salt. You want to put that in the bowl. Then you want to get the catfish fillets. Go ahead and like just mix it around in the mixture. Then we're gonna go ahead and alright guys for the frying mixture you're gonna wanna put butter, a lot of butter. Okay, you put butter, you're gonna wanna put the vegetable oil. and I'll heat it up and put the catfish fillets in. Alright, the oil is all ready, so we're going to go ahead and put the catfish fillets in there. Alright, first one. First one, don't jump in here. There you go. Alright, there's, there's our two. Looks pretty good. good. Alright, you want to cook them for about, I would say, four three minutes on each side, um, depending on how thick they are. Alright guys, gonna go ahead and flip the fillets. Alright, flip one. Flip one, go ahead and flip the other. Hold this one. There we go, flip both of them. Those are looking good. And now we're gonna sit for another four minutes. 
Alright, now let's sit for like two or three minutes on the other side. And then we're gonna go ahead and yeah, they'll be done. Alright guys, the fillets are done cooking. Gotta put them on a paper towel to drain the excess oil out of the fish. So we're gonna let it sit there for about a minute or two to let it cool off and let all the oil drain out. Alright guys, here's the finished product. Let's see how it tastes. Alright guys, that is it for the video. Um, hope you enjoyed. Make sure to hit the thumbs up button. Couldn't have done it without my boy, Ellis Fishing. Subscribe to me at Instagram. It's Ellis. Um, hope you enjoyed the video. Oh, and enter my giveaway. Make sure to subscribe to my channel. Check out my huge giveaway. And I'm follow me at giveaway. Instagram at npm_fishing. And I'm also doing a figure. That's it. So. Peace.